I was talking with one of my great clients um, about entrepreneurship, and I had to be honest with her about what it is she should expect. I think she's a couple of years into building a beautiful brand, a high-end brand, uh, a great product, great clients. But entrepreneurship is very, very fashionable today. A lot of people talk about starting your own business, doing your own thing. And it's wonderful. If it were up to me, everybody would be an entrepreneur because entrepreneurship provides enormous freedom and creativity. It gives you an opportunity to uh, put your, your voice and your products and your services out in the world. It gives you an opportunity to serve the clients that you want to serve, to write your own schedule, and to do the things that are important to you, uh, and, and to be your own person. But it's, it's difficult. You know, it's a difficult process. I was talking to her about, we were talking about hustle. So many people talk about hustle today, and hustle obviously is very important. But I, I, I gave her a couple of more, uh, a few more H's uh, that have to be included in addition to hustle, because she is certainly hustling. There's no question about it. But you need heart. You need heart. You need to be able to um, deal with the rejection that you get and to guard against that by having a lot of opportunities that you're working on. But that's just one of the realities of, our, of entrepreneurship. You see the glitter, you see the excitement, you see the, the, the people with the rewards, but what you don't see is the pounding on the phone, the knocking on the doors, the mailing out the packages, the going to the events, the, um, the dealing with the no and the no and the no and the no over and over again. That's, you know, that's entrepreneurship. You know, so often I'm, I'm at an event and I'm speaking to people about entrepreneurship and they're, and they're thinking, you know, wow, isn't it wonderful to see you there? Um, and, and they're thinking that we were invited. You know, sometimes I am invited, but a lot of times I'm knocking on doors to, uh, to talk with them about getting involved. So we talked about hustle. We talked about uh, heart, and, and, and you also have to consider hours. There's a lot of hours involved in perfecting your craft, perfecting your product, perfecting your marketing, perfecting your pitch. Um, uh, in some cases, it's, it's stuffing envelopes, it's packing boxes, it's shipping, it's driving across town, driving across states. There's a lot involved in the process, and uh, it, 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 it takes a lot of your uh, effort. Now, <clears throat> the other thing that is so important when it comes to entrepreneurship is what I would call height. You know, some people call this uh, um, altitude. But um, height is important because whatever you're doing, you've got to bring it up to a level that um, people look at what you're doing and they say, okay, this person has some distinction in what they're doing. This person is doing it at a higher level. This person is doing it louder, better, sharper. You've got to get that into the process. So entrepreneurship is an exciting period. And frankly, I think more people need to become entrepreneurs because um, the, 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 the market the, the employment market is such that um, it's very difficult trying to conform to what companies need and those companies are very often attracted to people who are not like you, who don't have the skills that you have or the education, they want some other education and you, you know, the entrepreneurship gives you the ability to go right for it. You can start today, right now and go for it. You don't have to worry about um, dressing yourself up and, and uh, uh, putting all the, the, uh, the bow on and all those things to be appealing in an environment that you might not even want to be in. Now, I, I'm not, this is not to disparage um, corporations or growing companies. In fact, one of the things I emphasize to my client that you need as an entrepreneur is another H, help. You need help. You need people who will help you not only do the work, you need people who will help lift you up when you're discouraged, people who will help you um, uh, if you have cash flow issues, people who will help you getting get new clients, 
people who will help you get new contacts. Uh, entrepreneurship seems like it's a, uh, a game that you play alone, but it's far from that. You are uh, playing it with many, many others. And in fact, that's one of the misnomers about entrepreneurship that you can sit alone. You know, I happen to be sitting alone right now, but I've got lots of people who work with me uh, in various locations. Uh, the misnomer is that somehow you're sitting alone and it's all happening by, um, uh, by, you know, by, by, you're doing it by yourself and you're not doing it by yourself. You're doing it with the help of others. So what did I say? Hustle, heart, uh, help, height. Um, those are just four of the H's that you really need to be a successful entrepreneur and hours. I, I don't know if I said hours, but you need hours in there. Um, you need hours to work on what you're doing. And frankly, there are many entrepreneurs I know, these are companies you don't know, but these are companies that are doing really well. They don't get, they're not on the cover of the business magazines. But one entrepreneur was saying to me the other day, you know, Andre, I've been doing this for 20 years. And after 20 years, we've hit our stride. We're making money. We've always made money, but we're making money consistently we're making money we've got a name in our market we've got people who understand how to do what is required I he said I understand as an entrepreneur what's required we've got a system going we've got a reputation so it takes time if you are out there as an entrepreneur I commend you because we need more people who are willing to step up and put their products out there because it's a life that is rewarding it is tough in the early going and it might be tough for a while but ultimately you will um, be more fulfilled you will make more money you potentially can make a greater contribution and you have the potential of leaving a legacy for your family and your loved ones so I applaud you entrepreneurs out there for sticking with it um, it is something that I commend you for, others commend you for. A lot of people will, re will see the rewards, but they don't know the work that's involved. Uh, but we know the work that's involved in the process. And uh, stick with it, stick with it, because uh, ultimately uh, you're going to prevail uh, if you're not prevailing already, and you're going to see the kind of success that you want to see.